Hey everybody, and welcome back to another episode. So in this one, I'm going to carry on doing work for the railroad, and I am going to meet Dr. Amari, uh, just because something's happened. I think there's like a synth here, and the path they take to get the synth out is compromised or whatever. So they've sent me, their best gun, Agent Bullseye, into the fray. Or fire, as Desdemona called it. So I'm here to kick ass. Hi. You're the contact H222 is talking about? Just when I thought one person could only experience so much danger in their life. The patient is resting right now. Were you hoping to say goodbye? I don't advise it. He's far past remembering anything about his old life. He doesn't remember anything. I'm very thorough. His new life started in a small homestead near Roxbury. That's all he knows now. While you can talk to him, no amount of coaxing can reverse the process. He won't remember you, and he never will. I didn't get a chance to say goodbye. He talked quite a bit about you before I administered the anesthetic. I'm sorry you didn't have the opportunity. Now, what's your plan for moving him? Uh... We have to use the original route. There's no other way. That's the plan? I thought your people valued discretion. <sighs> but fine. I won't argue. The Malden Metro Center is where you need to go. All the Gen 1s there need to be gone, understand? All of them. I'm leaving H-222 and his future in your hands. Once he's gone, we never had this conversation. He was never here. Before you leave, take the holotape on the table. It's a personal message We've for your ears only. For a spell. I was hoping to have some words with you. He is in a different outfit every time he talks to me. I'm used to flying solo, but I got to admit, working with you makes me think I've been missing out. Having someone watching your back is refreshing, especially since you never know when the Institute is watching. You've never had a partner? Not for a long time. Besides, partnering up in the railroad can leave you vulnerable. One more person who can finger you to the Institute. Some people at HQ are jealous. You took the big nap, and everyone you knew is long gone. Now, hear me out on the silver lining. If a human in the railroad slips up, then they expose friends and loved ones to danger. You're safe from that. Why would the people they care about be in danger? When the coursers start kicking down doors, they don't just hit railroad safe houses. Some friends and family have been known to get axed. Whether the Institute's motivated by vengeance or faulty intel, it doesn't matter to the people left behind. It doesn't matter much to me. I'm a simp. At least that's what they tell me. So, I really don't have anything to lose. For Glory and me and the others, it's easier to dedicate ourselves to the cause. You're a synth. Why didn't you tell me before? I don't like talking about it. I was one of the first synths they did the whole cranium reboot on, so... A bit of a botched job. Most synths have fun fake memories. A happy home, a family. Me, I got nothing. And that, well, it does something to you. Since we're traveling together, I want you to take this. It's my recall code. If you ever need to know something about the Institute, read it to me. What? Huh. What's the recall code do? That's the safety net the brain docs put in. An ejector seat to bring back your old synth self. I don't know for certain, but I imagine it's a big old wad of trauma and cupcakes. Except with no cupcakes. Don't use the code unless you absolutely have to. It'll wipe my memories. I'm not sure how much of me will even be left. You know, I'd just feel better if you didn't read it until you need it. Okay then. Uh, I'll take all this. Are you 
trying to impress someone? Come on, drop some of that. Who are you? Look alive. Hey, stay loading back. Loading up or loading off? Uh huh. All right. Yeah, I got too much. Uh, you can have that, Deacon. That weighed a lot. Wow. Where's this uh, thingy, Majiggy? Hollow tape. Who are you? you? Stay back. She said there was a hollow tape, right? Have I missed it? Be careful of the radiation. The glowing sea isn't a place to be caught unprepared. Oh yeah, I haven't done that yet. I'll get around to it. But yeah, there is no hollow tape around here that I can see. So I have no idea what she was on about. I will take the economy one to glue though. Uh okay, screw it. Let's carry on. Hey, stay back. Excuse me. The doc said I got some sort of contagious disease or something. I I'm under quarantine. In the quarantine. Alright, let's uh, go clear the way for him. Okay, where, where am I going? Ah, okay, that's a hefty travel. Alright, let's go up here. That seems like a bad, <laughs> bad design flaw, doesn't it? vault calling. Ah, right, yeah, the drive-in. I really have to come here at some point and just build this up a little bit. I mean, I can't believe there are people here, but... <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna have to come back and really fix this, I think. Anyway, though, let's uh, get to this place. A bit. Yeah. Brother of Steel are doing some patrol recon or whatever. Which is actually a good thing that I don't piss them off because, like, I could just be wandering around like I am now and just get attacked randomly. Which wouldn't help. Are you a raider? Are you bad? Evil? Good? Yeah. What's going on? What the hell is that? That scared the crap out of me. What's... Okay, moving on. Oh my god. What is happening? Alright, I'm getting up to you. Here we go. 
Um, yeah, right, I got some meat and, uh, oh my god. What is happening? Alright, let's go from, oh my god. Really? How many of these guys are there? That's another one. Yeah, I hope so. Ah, all that work I put into that. Oh well. Sorry, buddy. Minutemen. Cool. They're on, on patrols. That's nice. I need to go and uh, see what's happening at this place now. Where am I in relation to it? I'm not that far, actually. That's good. Alright, almost there. Uh, I've only got two fusion cores though. That could be a problem. Uh, probably me. Uh, not not major problem. It just means I'll uh, I'll have to like do the glowing sea fairly soon when I whilst I can still use my power armor, which means I have to get to the glowing sea. Don't think I have any other than Fort whatever it was Hagen. Where I fought Kellogg, that's the closest point I got to, uh... To thingy. Uh, am I... Fighting super mutants? Coffee cup. Okay, I'm almost dead. That's not good. Medford Memorial Hospital. Alright, that's not where I want to be. So that's, I'm fine with that. Just keep on going. My power armor has seen better days though. So I don't know how much good <laughs> it's going to be at this point. <laughs> we got assigned the same damn job. With all our compartmentalization bullshit, this sort of shit happens. You got the job from the good neighbor side. I got it from Griswold's safe house. How's this sort of thing happen? So Griswold's got trouble, and they send a cryptic note to HQ. Send in the big guns. And on the other side, the doctor's got troubles too. So she sends in her own damn cryptic note. And then comes the comedy. That's the price we pay for security. Don't tell me you buy into that crap. Sheesh. Well... Since we're both here, what do you say the two heavies join forces and rock the heavens a little? Gives me a chance to see what you and Deacon really get up to in the field. Usually it's spa days and macrame, but hey, I'm up for some mayhem. 
Let's do this, Glory. You lead the way, my friend. All right, I got two synths backing me up. We can do this. Okay, so the synths literally massacred the uh, raiders. Take this. What? Ah, uh, maybe I can't run. That sucks. Okay. Let's see if I can't get rid of something. I'll probably get rid of some of these actually. Like the battered fedora and whatnot. I'll put into the. There you go. You can take that back. Yeah, I'll put the battered fedora and whatnot um, into the chest. Steal all that ammo. Sweet, sweet ammo. Ah, what do you mean I can't run? Come on, really. Let's see what I got in my pockets. Yeah, you can take the bloody monkey. Yep, we got delivery, I think. Yep, that's my front door. Ah, uh, someone will answer. Oh not. Never mind, he's walked away. That was completely random, I know. Sorry about that. Uh right. There is the monkey. Fascinating. Won't be able to pick this. 
Hmm. All right. Ah, oh, this is so. This is ridiculous. The uh, right, let's find something else to throw away. Give that to Deacon. Where is Deacon? Deacon! Ah, uh, screw it, I'll drop it. Ah, it's so. Ah, what? I, mean, I picked up a can, okay? Uh, oh, I, I probably did that actually. Canister. Uh, fine, drop that. Pick up that can I dropped you. Every little bit helps. Out of the way, Gloria. Or glory, or whatever. Alright. Ah, she can handle it. She'll be fine. And um, yeah, what do you know? She killed most of them. You missed one. Well, they wipe the floor with these guys. Ugh. I really hate seeing that. I, I, I can't put into words just how much I hate seeing that. You are over encumbered. You can't run. Haha. <laughs> Ah, drop one. Right. Who's next? Uh, okay, can't go there. Yeah. Which way do I go? Alright, I'm a little lost as to where I'm supposed to be going. Damn it, I've only got one left.
Okay, we missed two, I think. According to this. Alrighty then, let's go. Handcuffs in the trash. Back to HQ to get my caps, to get my payment. Crouching will both improve your accuracy and activate sneak mode. But to be fair, I mean, if it if you have sneak if you're in a firefight, then sneak mode doesn't really mean mean much, does it? Security is worth the occasional crossed wire. Anyway, Amari reports H-222 made it out safely. Anything else I need to do? No. You've bought us time to find a new route out of the memory den. The crisis is over for now. Take this. You've earned it. Randolph safe house has got another dead for of Bunker Hill and our asset there is not widely known. Please keep it that way. Can do. You might want to focus on the valuable salvage. You'll break your back carrying worthless scrap. Where it is? Diamond City. Right, well that's pretty much it. Thank you all for checking out this video. It means a lot. Or well, this episode rather. I get used to saying episode rather than video. Uh, it means a lot. If you could be so kind as to leave a like maybe hit that comment section down below or hit that subscribe button one two or all three uh, any amount is very greatly appreciated and will help a lot until next time that's pretty much it for now so until next time you take care